What's up? Welcome to another edition of Honey's Place Live. I am your host, Lou Angenone, and my hostess with the most is Laura Sweet. And as you can tell, we do have a special guest on our couch today. It's Scott from Wet. Yo. What up, Scott? What's going on? How you doing? How you doing, my man? Good to see you, Laura. All is well? Everything's good. Excellent. Thank you guys for having me out here again. As always, you know, I want to start off by just thanking thanking you guys for all your support. Uh, you definitely are one of our top customers, and uh, our company continues to grow through your support. So thank you. And, and speaking of support, one of the things that I just want to start off and surprise you guys with is 5% um, of your purchases from us this month are going to go to um, the Save the Tatas campaign. Oh, wow. Um, hence Very me having cool. the pink on today. Great. Um, in honor of Breast Cancer Month. So, awesome. So, so Save the Tatas. Buy some Gotta wet. Gotta love that. Yeah. Buy some wet. Awesome. So we're excited to, to come here because we have a lot of new newness. Awesome. Um, you know, we're not a toy company, you know, so I, I don't launch 500 products, you know, every six months. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but what Gone. we're trying to do... <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. And we've actually discontinued more products than we've added over the past seven years. We realized that instead of, uh, you know, having a bunch of singles and doubles and home runs, we need to have grand slams. So the products that we manufacture are products that we put a lot of time and effort and thought into, and they're all consumer tested, which is very, very important. So, um, you know, I know sometimes we get a lot of requests from consumers about products they want us to come out with, um, and we hear all the consumers' requests. We appreciate it. Keep coming and telling us what you want, um, but we take our time in terms of coming out with product. Uh, we used to dictate what consumers were going to have from us, and now we let consumers dictate to us what they want, and so that's part of the process. So that translates to sales on the retail end. Basically, uh, what Scott's saying is everything you buy from Wet will sell. And that's the key. Right? That's the key, yeah. And, you know, we're spending a lot of time on the retail side, too. You know, we have two, two full-time trainers and merchandisers, so what you can do is contact, contact your rep here, and they can set up a training, and I'd be happy to send out a rep to your store to educate um, the clerks about our products. When it comes to lubricants, there's a lot to know. Yes, there um, is. It's, you know, you almost feel like you're a doctor when you're talking about yeah. lubricant. So we'd like to help uh, educate um, the clerks, because the clerks, in all reality, are the reason why we're in business. Right. If the clerks don't stand behind the products, it doesn't really matter. It's true. So, um, and as I always say, our biggest challenge that we have as, as uh, sales reps are, are PDAs because people have instant access to information. So if a, if a customer is at Shelp and they're reading a bottle and they see the word dimethicone, and the clerk doesn't know what the word dimethicone is, but they've Wikipedia'd it, we look kind of silly. Right. So we've got to get out there and be forceful about training. Um, so make so, sure to get your, talk to your rep. Yeah, anybody, any retail store out there that would like to have an in-store training for your clerks, what's on the streets, they will come to you. You can schedule that through your Honey's Place representative. Absolutely. There you go. Support. Yep. And if it's a ladies' night or a couples' night or any kind of event, you know, um, we always try to get somebody there. Um, if we can't get somebody there, we love getting samples, pouches out as well. Uh, you know, people like free stuff. You guys are on top of the pouches yeah. as well. You guys are on top of free samples of letting everyone try your stuff out. That's one thing i got to say about you guys. It's out there for everyone to try it. Great. I mean, you know, our, our perspective is if you believe in your product, you don't mind giving it out. Right. So uh, we know that if we can put a sample in somebody's hands and they go home and they try it, you know, they'll be able to experience the experience and come back and purchase a bottle. So don't be, don't be afraid to give out free stuff because we aren't. So you can also ask your sales rep at Honey's Place for, uh, for foil packets or pouches mm -hmm. for support for your events and other things as well. What has them available for pretty much everything that they make yep. on a constant basis. So you give a little free sample in with a sale and they come back and buy a bottle, right? Absolutely. Perfect. All right, so what do we have here? What's going on? We got some cool stuff. I'm gonna hop into some things that are um, products that we've had around for a couple years that we have either um, added a new size or repackaged. And then I'm gonna hop into some of our, our newness that we have as well. So newness. first I want to talk about our shave creams. Um, shave creams have been on the market for about three to four years now. They've done very well for us, but consumers requested a smaller size in the tube, and so we've launched a 2.8 ounce tube size of the product. Nice. Yeah, so it's TSA compliant. Yay. You don't have to worry about that. Um, the shave cream is an amazing product. Anybody who hasn't tried it, trust me, the best salesperson is someone who's tried the product. Um, so make sure you sample this product yourself. You're gonna love it. I was the guinea pig for this product. Somebody who grew up having razor bumps his entire life. I knew that if it worked on me, 
and work on anybody's yeah. anything. Um, and this is an amazing Anybody's product. Anybody's anything. So, and it is. It's an amazing product. We sell a lot of it. It's so we have it in a smaller size now. That's great. Something kind of funny too. Um, can, a lot of women are, have been emailing us or calling us saying that they're mad at their at their their husbands because they've been using their shave cream in the shower. <laughs> can you guess what they've been doing? <laughs> Who knew? So. Isn't that interesting. Yeah. A little not, manscaping. Not, not, no. Come for on. masturbation. A little masturbation. Ah, Guys, yeah. new shave creams is masturbation. Awesome. So, go for who it. Hey. Got to keep it conditioned down there, gentlemen. You know. Here you go. That's <laughs> nice. It probably everything's even. You could manscape after that too. A absolutely. Go for it. A little manscape, you know. <laughs> I shave my legs with that. It's pretty good. Who you knows? Know, I right? swim. You know, I do play water polo. You know. You, know you go much goes. faster that yeah, way. Yeah, right? a lot faster All like right. that. Aerodynamics. <laughs> I love it. And you know, and one of the things that we really appreciate is when, when you guys come to our website and give us um, a ways in which people are using our products, because that goes into our pitch. I mean, we sit in an office and we think we know everything we need to know about our products, but a lot of times, you know, we learn new things from the consumer side. Mm -hmm. So when you guys uh, hear new things about our products in terms of how they use, please let us know, let your reps know, or we have, a, we have an area on our site where you can let us know anonymously, if you don't want to be called out, <laughs> um, about ways the products can be used. Because those ideas we like to share with other consumers, and especially on the clerk side, we give them more reasons to sure. sell a product. It justifies the investment into what really is kind of a luxury item. Right. So, shave our, our massage oils. Um, so we've had our massage oils around for about 12 years now. Um, and they've been in our, in our torso bottle for a long time. Mm -hmm. Correct. Um, it was about time for us to relaunch the look of that product, and that's what we did. One of the knocks on on the torso bottles that we had is that customers couldn't tell that there was different aromas. So what we wanted to yeah. do with the new packaging was make it very clear and distinctive that there's five different aromas. Uh, we also added two new aromas. So we added Invigorate, which is a eucalyptus citrus blend. Ooh, that's nice. Very Sounds very invigorating. It very, mu very much so. <laughs> um, very similar to the smell you'd smell in a, sp in a spa. Nice. Um, and then we added cucumber melon. Mm. Now, top seller. Top seller. You know, cucumber melon, we found out, is the number two uh, smelling pheromone in the United States. Interesting. For women. So uh, cucumber melon, you really can't go wrong. People are very familiar with the smell ahead of time. Um, and once again, our quality, we have spa quality massage oils. So it's a high grade massage oils. Um, so you're not going to get cheated out. Two different sizes. We have the four ounce bottle, and then we also have the eight ounce bottle offering as well. So the torso bottles are gone, and these new, this new shape is in, and both sizes. Packaging pops. I like the packaging. Perfect. You know, it's it nice. Pops. Yeah. Okay. Good. So Very this is cool. The, the new look and feel. Great. Now, new, speaking of new, some of the things that we have that we recently launched, um, first and foremost is our Wet Wow, which has been extremely exciting for us. Once again, we talked about a, gr a Grand Slam. Wet Wow has been a Grand Slam for us. And what it is, it's a, it's a clitoral arousal gel. So it's, it's for women. Guys, it's for women, remember that. But it's also for us, because if your woman's happy, we're happier people as well. Um, and some of the key things that I think are, are, are important to point out about the product, first and foremost, is the packaging. Um, it's very elegant packaging. Uh, as you, uh, you know, Wet's always been kind of the fun brand, but we're trying to be a little bit more contemporary in the look of our new products as we change with the times as well. Um, so this is really going to pop on shelf. Um, there's two ways to merchandise it. One, you could have it sitting on a shelf, but it's also peggable as well. So it's diverse in terms of, um, of where you can put it in the store. Um, we also, it's a very reasonable price point, a suggested MSRP. Uh, there's two different formulas. One is the Gentle O, and then there's the Max O. On the Gentle O, suggested MSRP is $15.95, and on the Max O, it's $17.95. Oh, that's wow. great. Yeah. Not bad at all. So we're a lot of, a lot of clitoral ar arousal gels that are out there are around $19.95 to $24.95. We decided to be economically responsible nice. in our offering. And how many product. uses are in each one of those two? 75 applications. Wow. So, wow. Um, so a little bit goes a long way. So like I said, there's two different formulas, Gentle O and Max O. Um, the difference between Gentle and the Max is the Max is 50% stronger than the, than the Gentle O. Wow. Okay. So if it's something you haven't used before, you want to go easy and try it out, start with the Gentle. And then I think if you apply more of the Gentle, then it gets a little bit less gentle. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> ultimately. You know, um, we always say be responsible with these products, especially if you've never tried them before. Um, everybody's reaction is going to be different when it comes to these type of products. So uh, we say use a basically a pea-sized amount, um, and that should be enough to, to invoke arousal. 
cool. in the clitoral area. Um, so what's great about the product is we also sample our wet synergy inside of the product because we're always cross merchandising. Um, and then we also have this really neat guide which shows customers um, where the clitoral area really oh, is. Good. Where's the clit? You know, you'd be surprised how many people don't know. It's by the tank, right? Uh, somewhere. Oh, over there. You know. <laughs> so I would ask, you know. Fellas, I say you should take this and put this in your wallet so we can always know where it is. Because I'm tattooed on it. <laughs> 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 like a quarterback. Whatever What's you need play? to do, technically. Tutorials. Educate yourself and you guys are helping. You got you got to know. Packaging. Because it's amazing how many people just don't know. Where, where the clip yeah. is, you know. It sounds so simple, right? But not so much. We hear from a lot of women, oh, you know, my man, he's putting lubricant or he's putting clitoral gel over on everything, but where it needs to go. So we're trying to help people out with that. That's good. Nice. And as I... The price is awesome on because for under 20 bucks, you're getting yourself a great orgasm every time. 75, 75 huh? orgasms. I'm like, yeah. hello. Um, it's cool. We have like a, a nice needle nose as well oh, on good. here. So once again, a tiny little bit um, on your fingertip and it, it, you're good to go. The product, now the product is a water-based uh, arousal gel, which is important to know. There's a lot of oil-based products that are out there. And the problem with oil-based products is you can't use condoms after right. it, and you, and you can't use toys. So who wants to get aroused and have to clean up and then use a toy or have sex yeah. with a condom? No. So this is a water-based product, and we also put a drop of silicone in there. And what that does is it makes the product stay on longer. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so, in all, so it really is kind of a, kind of a hybrid yeah. um, arousal gel. Interesting. Um, there is a vasodilator in there. I love those big words, vasodilator. And the name of our vasodilator is nicotinate. Um, so we don't use it, a arginine. Um, um, there's no niacin in it. It's nicotinate it's great. Is, is what's in there. Good, good. Um, and then also some mint, and that would, that's what provides some of the tingling sensation as well. So this is a really cool product. Um, once again, consumer approved. We tested this with hundreds of consumers before we even launched it. So we know that um, customers love this product. And we are moving it. We're moving both. Um, a lot of girls go big, right to the the, the max. Like the oh. intense. Mm -hmm. um, but you definitely need. There is a there is a purpose for the the milder version. Yeah, you get your you training know. wheel version. Right. And your hardcore version. So and and we are selling them well. It's in stock. Um, how, how long does it take for a female to uh, start to feel the effects of this? We, the, the recommended um, uh, way to use the product is to rub it in for five minutes. Now, it sounds kind of funny, right? Because you're probably going to be done after rubbing it in for five minutes. But um, <laughs> that is the recommended usage. But once again, every single person is going to be different. So you're going to have some customers who are going to feel it right away and some who are going to, it's, it's going to take, take longer to get in the bloodstream. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Got it. Yeah. So everybody's different. Really you just don't know. And right. you know, and the guy can have some sensation from this as well, because there is mint inside of it. Mm -hmm. The guy will can feel a tingling sensation as well, which nice. ultimately will provide him some arousal. So guys were not cheated out of the experience as well. And hopefully sometime in the near future we're gonna come out with an arousal product specifically for men. So stay tuned for that. Stay nice. Tuned. Perfect. So wet wow. Any other questions wet about wow. wet wow? No. Wow. Wow. Um, and our other product, I think it's kind of funny that this year the two products that we've come out with are our wow and Uranus. Um, so wow, Uranus. <laughs> wow, um, Uranus. <laughs> but up, up. Um, so Uranus. So we wanted to come out with with an anal product, an anal lubricant. Um, we've never had an anal lubricant. I mean, all of our lubricants can be used anally, um, but we never came out the product that that's specific, specific to to anal usage. And we wanted to have fun with the product, and so we figured. You know, uh, with this Fifty Shades of Grey effect that we're all experiencing, which has been awesome, right? We have this new consumer who's coming to the stores who are trying things they would never have tried before. Um, and anal sex is just not as taboo as it used to be. Um, so we actually had a contest, and somebody, somebody in our warehouse is the one who came up with the name of this. So we say Uranus for the astronaut in you. <laughs> um, so, you know, we think that anal sex should be fun. Um, and that's kind of what we're doing with the packaging. So we have two different formulas. Uh, one is our water-based formula, which is going to be the blue bottle. And then the other is our, is our silicone formula, which is the red bottle. OK, so blue for water and red for silicone. You got it. Not warming and cooling. No, no sensation in our products. Got it. Um, okay. One of the things that, that we have figured out through um, talking to consumers is that 
We don't really recommend this sensation when it comes to anal sex. Yeah, I, exactly. Because I one of the problems with any type of numbing or cooling product that's out there is that, um, let's say, for instance, your partner or you don't feel the feel the sensation, or you feel the sensation, which is numbing the anal area, you don't know how hard they're pushing. Right. So as soon as that sensation wears off, all of a sudden you realize you that... sit down? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Power Ranger, yeah. all bad. Um, so... <laughs> So we recommend for for the the non pro anal sex uh, consumer that they go with the non sensation product. I agree. Um, so what makes these products different than like our wet original or wet platinum? Because um, you know we're not one of those companies who try to do uh, you know same juice, uh, different use. Right. Uh, we actually have to come up with creative and new products. Um, both of these products are are thicker um, okay. in nature. So this the water base is thicker than our wet original and the uh, silicone is thicker than our wet platinum. That provides more viscous, more slip, um, which ultimately provides more cushion to the pushing. Um, you have so many good little cliches <laughs> going, good ones. man. I'm waiting to see the ad wow. Wow. On this. Well, <laughs> Anal same sex. juice, different what? Same what? juice, different use. Wow. It's, yeah. it's wet Uranus. <laughs> Anal sex is fun. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, anal, disclaimer, anal sex can be fun. Oh, it can be fun. My <laughs> bad. Can My bad. Be. Um, so, um, um, the product also is uh, it's hypoallergenic, which is very important. Um, like I said, there's no sensation. Um, it's manufactured in our FDA-approved manufacturing facility. So, it's under the same strict guidelines that we have for all of our other products. So, we're not having this manufactured somewhere else and yeah. brought into us. Awesome. That's we're doing good. all of this in house. Got it. Um, three great sizes we have uh, the small size, we have a large size, and then we have the uh, professional Woo. pump size. It's the big dog size yeah. right there. And you'd be very surprised how many of these large pump sizes we sell. Um, one of the things that we know in this economy is that if there's something that you're using that you like, you're going to make the investment into getting a larger size. It's true. From a cost per ounce perspective. Right. So, um, and the professional, um, the people who are using, who have anal sex the most, you know, they typically are using this product on a weekly or daily basis. Well, and this makes more sense. You need lubricant for anal sex. Period. So, yeah. There's that, no way around yeah, it. Yeah. Your, your, your anal region is not providing you with lubricity. It's right. not, you know, naturally. It's not a natural. Being developed there, and if it is, that's probably not a good thing. So, um, <laughs> just so you know, if anal, that's you something you do, it, yeah. I'm just, I'm Sorry. just saying. <laughs> <laughs> um, but also, too, you know, I always want to recommend that we have a really amazing FAQ section on our website. So, um, and our FAQ, our, our frequently asked questions, are driven by what customers ask us and us answering their questions back. Um, um, I know that you know. A lot of times when customers come in, they're very nervous about talking about these products. Um, so I recommend that you forward them to an area where they can do some research themselves. Um, and that's stayswetlonger.com forward slash FAQ. You Got know, it. It's a great area for information about our entire it's product. It's just information line. only. Your clerks can go there to read up on it. Um, you can read up on it, and if your customers are uncomfortable, they can go there too. Does it say that, like on that little card inside of it? Um, yes, we do direct them okay. over to the FAQ section so. on the card as well, which this is the card that we all need to have in our wallets. Right. So pull it out and look up the FAQ website if you got a question about any other loops. One thing I did forget to talk about um, with the Uranus is that it's a, it's a paraben free product oh, okay. as well. So um, there's no parabens in the silicone or the water based product. Which brings it back to the hypoallergenic situation. Mm -hmm. So it's very safe to use. You got it. So. And for those who don't know, parabens are a preservative. And um, there's been some studies that some parabens may cause different types of cancer. Oh. Um, and so instead of debating the issue with consumers, because we could probably debate that all day long, right. we just decided to take it out. Perfect. So. Great. So this is new on the market just recently. We definitely have all the sizes in stock mm -hmm. and we're selling them no problem. So it's available and selling. So I think everyone needs to take, take a trip to Uranus. Add Uranus to your order. Is, isn't that where the NASA put the probe is on Uranus? Yeah. Or, they, yeah. I think they used WOW to make it happen. <laughs> wow. Wow. Wow, it happened. Uranus. <laughs> When you want to go to the black hole, <laughs> you know, there it is there. <laughs> Very appropriate time. <laughs>
We can go go on all day. Uh, uh, Keep in mind that we had this product in development for four months before we even launched it, so you can only imagine the exciting oh, times right. that, that we had at Wet Lube. Uh, I'm sure it's super fun. Yeah, never a boring day right? when selling lube. Um, so those are our new products that we have. Um, but I also wanted to talk about some of the, how we support these products. You know, it really is the push pull mentality. Um, I can get as much product on shelf um, as I want, but if I'm not trying to, if I'm not generating any pull from shelf, it doesn't matter. Right. So pushing is getting product on shelf, and pulling is generating customers to buy the product. And we do that by through through numerous tools. One, we do it through sampling. That's our pouches. Um, two, we do it through education. So the more the clerks know and can educate consumers about the product, the more convinced consumers are about buying the product. Right. And then three, it is our POP and our different types of displays that we have that are on counter or our, our floor displays. So um, I want to just talk to you guys a little bit about what Absolutely. we have to help support the product. Go ahead. Let's so try. we've got a counter display for uh, Synergy. And I think everybody probably knows about Synergy. I think I've talked about Synergy before. Um, and if you guys haven't heard about Synergy before, you can probably go back and look at the last video that we did Correct. together. Right. Right. It's Synergy a great seller for us. Yes. We do great with this yeah. line. Excellent. Um, and we have a counter display for Synergy as well. One of the things that we'll be adding in the near future to, Syner to the Synergy counter display are actually testers oh, good. on the display. Awesome. Um, what's great about this display too is it's not some cheap, clunky display. A lot of times companies will put out like you know little corrugate displays and they get dirty and after, after a month you want to throw them away. Right. With this, this is acrylic on the bottom, nice acrylic top, and the display is self-merchandising. What I mean by that is consumers can get the information they need by reading the display. There are tons of customers who go into stores who don't want to talk to a clerk. You know, they're nervous. Once again, Fifty Shades customers are coming in right. for the first time. Right. And so they don't particularly want to talk to anybody. So we need to be able to provide them the information easily and clearly, um, and we're able to provide that information on the displays. Great. We also have a display for ecstasy. Um, and for those who don't know, ecstasy is our tingling silicone and tingling water. So where Synergy is a hybrid lubricant, ecstasy is a tingling silicone, 100% silicone, or, and, or water, 100% water. Right. So. Water, silicone, tingling. Yep. You got, got it. it. And so we have displays for both of those. <coughs> the thing with these counter displays is it draws the attention to the product. It's You go to CVS or Walmart mm -hmm. or anywhere else, the, the manufacturers of hair products, body lotions, whatever, they have these types of displays for a purpose. It, it draws your eye, your attention to the product instead of having a shelf with a ton of different kinds of lubes all together. Exactly. Um, it, it, it is going to increase your sales. Plus it gives you a breakdown of exactly what's in that display. The so education if you have any questions, it's educated right it's there. It's very, very helpful. The, the draw of the display is also helpful for the people to grab. Absolutely. Bye. And one of the things that we recommend as well is don't take this display and pop it in the middle of the lubricant section. Um, take this and put this cross merchandise. Put this right in the middle of your lingerie section. Put it in the middle of your toy section. Because there's customers who may be coming in to buy toys exactly. or lingerie. They aren't thinking about lubricant. They're not thinking about it. So now you can remind them right. that I need to have a lubricant. I mean, you know, and I, and I address this every time. You know, if we're trying to increase our average sale, a lubricant is the perfect upsell and cross sell to every single thing in that store. Right. So um, take these and find creative ways. This doesn't just have to sit on a, on a countertop. If you have long hooks, they can also go on a slat wall and this can sit on a slat wall as well. But you can also go somewhere, even a garage sale, and get one of those cute little stands and just pop it up on there that'd be a nice little accent to your store it kind of makes it feel a little bit more homey absolutely you know what I mean and you just pop it right in a certain area um, you could get different looks that way you can paint them different colors whatever I mean um, get creative but just because it's called a counter display doesn't mean it has to be on the counter where your register is taking up your counter space your glass space or whatever you can find different ways to pop these around your store for cross merchandising, end caps of aisles, videos, mm -hmm. lingerie, whatever. So um, there's just, you know, pay attention when you go to different other stores and see how they're merchandising and see how you can pop stuff in around like this. Plus lubricant's a great upsell for anybody who's buying a toy. Well, anytime you go store. into a store, you probably want to get a new lube. I mean, don't you always need more lube? Of course, so gotta have it. The average consumer buys two and a half to three bottles per year. See? So, so. and that's the average consumer. So, right. and the averages are going up because you know one of those uh, secrets about lubricants is they're addictive. 
you know, once you have sex with lubricant, it's hard to not do have utilize the lubricant again. And then you want to try different ones, you know, you want to try the tingle, you want to try the hybrid, you want to, yep. you know, yep. try the shave cream in the shower. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't know anything about you that. You never know. Wouldn't know anything about that. <laughs> that was a testimonial. Um, and one of the things that we that we've seen that um, stores who have our different displays, we see a twenty five to thirty percent increase in sales. Right. So I mean, there is a definite uh, you know immediate reaction to bringing attention to the products. It's yeah, and it's the attention and the education combined with this exactly. type of display. Yep. So what are the other options you have? And so I'll hop up over here and show you our large display. So this is our this is our floor display that we have here, um, and this is great for stores who have the, the the retail footprint to be able to have this display. And I know that every store is going to be able to have the the floor space for this, and so we're going to talk about our ten piece modular option. But for those stores who do have the floor for uh, floor space, this is a great option. Once again, it's well merchandised. It's got wet splash all over it. Um, customers, this display is double sided, so what you see here would be identical on the back of the display as well. Um, so it doesn't have to be against a wall, it nope. can be in the middle. And you know, I like to tell retailers all the time, this is something I say to like my customers or their clerks or whatever, go and stand in a spot in your store. And if you can stand and, and spin in a circle and not really touch anything, that spot you can start making money on right now by okay. popping a display like this yep. in. Because a display <clears throat> like that is really no, no bigger than a person. You got it. I mean, you can see I'm 5'10 I'm, I'm and a half. Five, ten and a half, because when you're in your six feet, you got to get your half. Um, <laughs> but so this display is about six feet tall. Um, and so the height isn't even so much as the space. Yes. I mean, it's as big as, you know, each one of us, depending on whoever, however you stand there, this is where you make money right here, right now. Yep. So there's your display. People can shop around that. And you can make money. So if you can stand there, you can make money there. Yep. That's two, it. Two feet across. And one of the things that, the reason why we made this display um, double-sided made a double-sided option is because there are customers who don't want to stand behind somebody while they're looking at lubricant, right? So the last thing you want to do is be standing next to some other dude. Hey, bro, how's that silicone lubricant, you know? Right. So <laughs> be your point, that, yeah, actually. Yeah, yeah, so you can go on the other side. And, and, and do your business right, over there right, and right. not have anybody in your business. Yeah. Um, if you purchase this display with the prepack, this comes with a tester set. But one of the exciting things that Honey's Place has available now are these displays as a, as a free option as well. And so that means we all know that you already have a wet inventory on hand. So you're not forced to purchase a whole other inventory to have this display. You take your existing inventory, pop it on the display, and then make a supplemental order to fill it in. So wow. that you're taking up the space properly. So you don't have, you know, it doesn't have to be um, an overwhelming investment. Exactly, you don't need to spend three grand to fill right. up a display. Right, yeah. you can work with what you have, fill it in, and be functional and productive that way. And we're and we're excited to have partnered with you to yeah. do this. I mean, this, this is a six hundred fifty dollar value. This display alone. It's making a big impact, and there's been many many people have taken advantage of it. And all you have to do is get a hold of your Honey's Place representative. We can order them and have them to you in a couple weeks. Got it. Awesome. So. Now the versatility of this display. Now, say for instance, um, some stores don't want to have a double sided display because they're worried about theft, right? If there's somebody on the other side, maybe the bottle of lubricant will slip in their pocket. Well, there's different ways to, to avoid that. Number one, if you have the display sideways, you can see both sides of the display. Or if you have it close to the, to the register where, uh, where a clerk can watch, you're not going to have that problem. But if that's still an issue for you, the thing that we can do is these panels right here pop out. And this panel will come out, and you can actually put this against the wall. So now you have a single-sided display. So there's versatility in the display. Each one of these panels don't have to go in there. That's only if you want to make it double-sided. So that's the key thing with these displays is making sure that they can be versatile. And this display provides that versatility. And if you want to pop it back in, it just easily pops back, pops back in like that. And once again, you have a double-sided display. That is, that is your option. Um, in terms of how you want to set the display up yourself. I mean, technically, if you wanted to put it against the wall like that because you like the pink backing and you don't want it double-sided, that's your option, too. That, that thing can pop back anywhere you want it. You got exactly. it. You so got it's, it. that's very versatile, and you just have to figure out how it works best for you. Um, but again, it draws attention to the product, and it's a nice way to, to display the product. And, and WET's providing you with a free shelf for their product. You got it. So, hey. So I got one more display I want to show you oh, guys. Okay, if you guys cool. don't mind uh, running with me over to take a look at this. Let's go. Right. 
Our other option that we have um, from a display perspective is our 10-piece modular display. And this is really cool, we're really excited about this. Um, once again, we spared, uh, we didn't spare any investment in terms of developing a nice looking display. It's good quality. Great quality. Um, the backs of these displays are metal um, oh, nice. and the trays are acrylic. Nice. Um, so this is a really going to be a piece that will stay in the store for a and long time. That looks time. like Nordstrom's, really. That, that was our goal. You know, we wanted to have something that you'd have at Nordstrom's or Sephora that uh, once again is going to not be intimidating to the consumers that are coming in the store and that are going to match the look and feel. I mean, a lot of stores are, are a lot more female friendly, a lot more couples friendly, very boutique-y. Um, and so I th we think we designed something really cool for, yeah. for the stores in that option. It's very eye-catching altogether. I love um, the education pieces around. Yep. Um, what's great about that, we talked a little bit earlier about customers who don't want to talk to clerks and want to get the information they need. In these shadow boxes, there are uh, information about the products that are recommended to go on those shelves. So customers can walk up and get the three main selling points for every single product without even having to talk to anybody at all. So this acts as a salesperson in your store. Uh, this display alone is a clerk for you. So what is this display called? So this is our 10-piece modular display. And what's, what's great about the 10-piece modular display is that um, there's multiple ways to set it up. Here we have it set up as a 10-piece, um, but you can also set it up. These all slide. So okay. we so recommend you set that it up your own way you want. You got store. it. We recommend that you can also cross merchandise. So for example, let's sit here and say you have it set up like this. Cool. Really cool design. Experience. Now what you can do is that put is toys yep. inside of each section here. Wow. So let's say for instance, you know, we've got uh, our water-based section. Well, maybe you want to put toys that are that are perfect with with water-based products there, or maybe your silicone toys. And put so waterproof toys. Waterproof like toys. So there's a lot of the ways you can cross merchandise and put different things in here that customers once again they weren't even thinking about buying a yeah. lubricant, and now they're reminded to buy a lubricant. So another thing I think you can do, even if you don't have this much space all together, you can pop one of those little pieces around different areas in your store. Look at how cute is that? You got it. You can have two. You can have two five-piece sections if you want to. Do something like that. You can have individual pieces in different parts of the store. So it's super duper versatile in terms of fitting in the look and feel of any store that's out there. And I know it's People are challenged with the, with the amount of wall space they have but I guarantee you can find a room with this yeah. display. I mean, you could start with four uh, as a block this way, if this is how your space is, or, you know, however you can fit it this way, this way, take these off and put them somewhere else, or put them somewhere, maybe not put them at a wall right now, but then in a week figure it out. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it's it's modular. That's that, and that's the key. Uh, it, one of the things that we also learned from, from our past displays is that we had too much product on it. Right, and so the problem with overloading a display with product is that the turns don't look good, and it makes the entire line look bad. Right. Right. So on this display, we don't go more than four deep of any product on here, and that's typically how much you have on a shelf anyway. Which is perfect because now you're not overloaded with back stock of lubricant. You, you have it. just what you need, and we are your warehouse. So just call us up Sorry. next week and get another order. Place your order online. Yeah. I'll fill an order for you every day if you want. And we also have these empty as well. From uh -huh. yeah, we sure do. Yeah. So that's another option. Um, one or the other or both. Yeah, and I okay. want to show show the large display actually with product. So this is what it looks like when it has product inside of it. Once again, this is the option to go against the wall. There's no inserts inside of there. So this is what it would look like. But we don't overstock this display. We don't go more than five deep on any skew on this one. And one of the advantages of the large display is that this, this one comes with a tester set. So this has a set of testers on the display. So customers who are coming in and, and uh, who want to try the product, they have testers they can try. And so that's not, that's not your investment, those testers. Like normally you have to buy the bottle to open it, to mm -hmm. let people test it. They come with a marked testers. You got it. And so that's a bonus of buying it full. Mm -hmm. Again, if that's something you can't do at this time, you don't have to. Right now it's available empty. You got it. Take your existing inventory and make your money that you have now work for you and, and increase your sales 25% by you getting it. a display of your choice or both kinds. And if I'm not mistaken on this as well, if a store was a smaller, let's say, small lingerie store and we only mm -hmm. carry, let's say, your massage oils, I could just have one of these displays on my wall with just your massage oils you by got itself. It. Yep. So that's great. So if you had a smaller store, you could do one or two. If you had a bigger store, you could do all of them. Yep. It's mix and match, so to say. And in the next couple weeks, one of the things that we'll have available for download on our website in the marketing area 
are different inserts that customers can print. Oh, so let's say, for example, that nice. you, you, for some reason, don't carry Intimo. Um, we have different ones that are that are going to be uh, more versatile. It'll just say water based. Oh, It'll say silicone based. Good. Um, and that way. Uh, if for some reason you don't carry some of these SKUs, it's not going to look funny. People are going to ask. Or even, I them. think even if you don't have to feel boxed into the space Correct. is a better way to put it, maybe. If you want to be able to have a, a, a different assortment, of, a fuller assortment of wet products, mm -hmm. then you're not boxed in to having to use this shelf for this product. You got it. That's very good. Yeah, and that came smart. through suggestion from yeah. a lot of the stores. For example, we had a number of gay stores who just said, look, we don't carry your, your flavored lubricants. You know, we carry a lot of the wet platinum and a lot of the wet original. I'll stock the whole thing with wet platinum and wet original if I have the, the necessary uh, inserts for this. Exactly. So the inserts are available and the inserts just pop in right here. Oh, that's so nice. um, you can even come up with your own inserts over time. So let's say, for instance, you wanted to run, you know, 20% off on a certain SKU that's on this shelf. You can make your own insert, drop it right in there and you're good to go. Wow. Versatile nice. and modular. You got it. That's good. So wet supports you. I mean, you've got the foils, you've got the displays, you've got the education. I mean, you guys are really putting yourselves out there to make sure that your product is selling and that you're standing behind it. It's Absolutely. completely, there's no reason why anybody shouldn't be doing great with wet product in their store. Absolutely. So. And you know, with partners like Honey's Place, we really can't lose. And I, you know, I want to thank all the customers out there who supported our brand for the past 23 years. Uh, you know, we plan on being around for another 23 years. So we're really putting our, our time, effort, and our money where our mouth is to ensure that we have this continued success. I think it's really classy and nice and, and, and smart. Yeah. So um, anyways, uh, wet, all products are, are available through Honey's Place. All of them all are the time. available. And um, anyway, so we'll wind it up I here. think Ooh. that's it. Scott, thank you very much. It's great having you again. Always nice. Thanks, And thank you. Appreciate it. And thank you. Ooh. Anything from wet, call your Honey's Place rep. We'll get it right out to your store. From Lou and Laura with our guest Scott, let's go sell some lube. Peace out. Thanks.